The lion is no longer the king of the jungle. Once upon a time, in a forest, there was a deer who claimed to be the king of the forest. The lion who heard this became very angry. How dare the mouse deer call himself the king of the jungle? Even though I am clearly the king of the jungle, said the lion in his heart. So the lion went to find a deer to make calculations with him. When he met the mouse deer, the lion said, Hey Cancel, how dare you call yourself the king of the jungle? I am the king of the jungle. Mouse deer said, Hey lion, now you are no longer the king of the jungle. If you don't believe me, let's prove it. So the lion and the deer both went into the forest. Soon they met the rabbit. When the rabbit saw the deer, he was calm, but when he saw the lion next to the deer, he immediately ran away. But the clever mouse deer said to the lion, Look, the rabbit is afraid of me. I am the king of the jungle. The lion couldn't take it for granted, he asked for more proof. So they walked deeper and deeper into the forest. Then they met a wolf. Of course the wolf is not afraid of the mouse deer. But when he saw the lion beside the deer, the wolf also ran helter-skelter. Once again the deer claimed to be the king of the jungle. The lion who began to doubt, asked for proof once again. Meet them with a zebra. Of course the zebra is not afraid of the mouse deer. But when he saw the lion beside the deer, the zebra immediately ran to pee. Finally the lion said, it's true, now you are the king of the jungle. The story above seems very simple, a story that may be told to children. But the meaning of the story is very deep. You can use the mouse deer's mind that uses the lion in real everyday life. To be successful, we need tools, we need levers. The lion is our tool and lever. The question is who is your lion? Your task now is to start looking for your own lions. If you associate with a lion then you will become a lion too. Thank you for watching.